cubic polynomial and here the zeros are given 1 by 2 1 and minus 3 so let's see the answer so first here I'm going to assume let alpha equal to 1 by 2 and here beta equal to 1 and the next is gamma that is equal to minus 3 so this all are zeros so you cannot confuse the meaning of zero this zero and that both are not the same this zero that means the value of x okay value of x inside the polynomials now first uh, I'm going to calculate the sum of zeros so sum of zero that I'm going to calculate so alpha plus beta plus gamma so 1 by 2 the next is plus and thereafter 1 and here minus 3 now if you calculate this one 1 by 2 plus 1 this is minus 3 so 1 by 2 1 minus 3 minus 2 and if you calculate this is 1 and here 4 and 2 so this is minus 3 by 2 so this is here alpha plus beta plus gamma equal to minus 3 by 2 that comes now the next is here I am going to calculate alpha into beta beta into gamma and gamma into alpha so product of uh, zeros so alpha into beta 1 by 2 into 1 then here 1 into minus 3 then here minus 3 into 1 by 2 so this come 1 by 2 this here plus minus minus 3 and this here plus minus minus 3 by 2 so the next is here 2 is the LCM this is 1 and this is 6 and this is 3 here now the next is uh, uh, 1 6 this is now 9 by 2 and this is here minus 8 by 2 it come 4 so here the value that come minus 4 so minus 4 that come product of now the next is uh, here we need to calculate alpha beta and gamma product of alpha beta and gamma so here alpha beta and gamma that I am going to calculate so alpha value is now here 1 by 2 and beta is now 1 and this is here minus 3 so here you can see the value that come here minus 3 by 2 now the next is uh, here we have the formula so formula of formula of cubic polynomials so what exactly is the formula of cubic polynomial so that is now here first uh, thing is we need to write here x cube then minus so alpha beta and gamma and here x square the next is product of 0 alpha beta plus the next is here beta gamma and here gamma alpha and here this is now x after that the next is the constant part is now alpha beta and the gamma so this is x cube now alpha beta gamma what exactly is the value that comes minus 3 by 2 so this here minus 3 by 2 x square and alpha beta product of this alpha beta beta gamma that comes minus 4 
this here minus 4 x and this here alpha beta gamma delta sorry alpha beta gamma product that's come minus 3 by 2 so now here x cube and minus minus plus so this is now 3 by 2 x square plus minus minus this is here 4x and plus minus this is here 3 by 2 so here I am going to take the LCM so here I am going to take the LCM 2 is the LCM that comes so this is now 1 here and this is here 1 so 2 divided with 1 2 come 2 multiply with x cube this is now 2x cube and this is here 3x square and this is here 8x and this is here 3 now this is the remainder is 2 here so there is the important points let's so assume this is here fx this polynomial is now fx okay after that uh, here we can write 0 of the polynomial is the value of x value of x so so that where we fx equal to 0 so here we can write now 2x cube plus 3x square minus 8x plus 3 divide by 0 sorry divide by 2 equal to 0 or we can write doing the cross multiplication then this is here 2x cube 3x square minus 8x plus 3 equal to 0 into 2 that is equal to 0 okay so we now we can write here fx equal to 2x cube plus 3x square minus 8x plus 3 so this is our required polynomial and this is the answer of this questions so one time going to repeat this all so here you need to first calculate alpha plus beta plus gamma then product then alpha beta gamma use this formula and this is suppose this is fx and put the value then you can get this terms after that here this is fx now we know already know 0 of the polynomial where the value of x so that here or where fx equal to 0 so that uh, I put the value 0 there after doing the calculus cross multiplication then or uh, 2 into 0 that is 0 and here this that comes and this place we can write here fx so fx equal to this all comes okay so this is the way we can get here cubic polynomial of this questions where zeros are given zeros that means here x value that given and if you put the value of x 1 by 2 then definitely the that come it's equal to 0 or if you want to put the value of x 1 definitely that come 0 that's equal to 0 so i hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you